All right, guys. Um, we just lost to the care to, to the Arizona Cardinals. Failed. Arizona Cardinals, twenty-five, twenty-two. Okay. Um, the Arizona Cardinals were without their number one receiver, Hopkins, uh, James Conner, which is a monster running back, and man, why can't Rondell Moore? Just kidding. And Rondell Moore, a a um. Somebody I'm, I'm literally afraid of for our defense because he's one of those guys that can catch a little two-yard pass and, and, and is seriously a, um, a problem to a tackle. Now, my problem with this game, offensively, defensively. Our offense did not play well all game. All game. You know, I, I, Dak did what he could. But a lot of play, just especially, I, I tried to get it through with people in my head, especially the, the play that he fumbled, no blocking. Tyron Smith, no blocking. Where was our running game in all of this, <laughs> this, this game or whatever? And it was just, we never saw any, any consistency with our offense. It was a lot of drops. There was, it, it was just, it was just, it looked like, you skipped over the Washington game and went right before the Washington game and how our offense is disjointed. And my point is, when we play good teams and they have something for our offense, we don't seem to be able to counter that and still be productive. It's still, in my mind, it goes back to the Jason Garrett days when the Dallas Cowboys are allowed to do what we want to do we will roll you. But as soon as you do something on defense to make us try to change, we can't we can't adjust. And that's been that's been since day one. You know what I'm saying? And this is another on, on the offense, we couldn't adjust. Now, another thing, our defense, they showed a list of the quarterbacks that our defense have faced over the past five weeks. And it's really embarrassing. You know, Heineke, Kyler Allen. Uh, there, there was just like bad quarterbacks that we faced. And we're like, oh, our defense is great. Our Dan Quinn, our defense is great. And we have been facing offenses that are basically inept. Offenses that are basically can't score on your average defense in the NFL. That's what offenses we, are, we have been beating with our defense. And that this game, I know a lot of you will put a lot on our offense. But there, at the end, our defense, we couldn't make a stop there. And that is, that is a serious problem. Like, I don't see it. If we could beat this team without Rondell Moore, without Hopkins, and without uh, James Conner, then it's going to be so hard to beat this football team. Our defense didn't look like, oh, we had an off game. Our defense looked like they could do what we want to do with our defense. And it feels like... To me, I'm sorry, it feels like to me our turnovers and the high number of turnovers have made our defense look a little bit better than it actually is. Than it, now, I'm not saying it's not good, but it's a, it's a difference when you're going up against Tyler Heineke and Kyler Murray. It's a difference when you're going against Kyle Allen and Tom Brady. You know what I'm saying? And then in this next level, we're going to have to go against Tom Brady. Aaron Rodgers, Matt Stafford, uh, 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 Kyler Murray, and those four quarterbacks, those quarterbacks can beat our defense. So it's not only one side of the football that's a concern. It's both sides of the ball. So, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We still, have, we still have a chance. It's not like they're not like that much better than us, but what I saw today, going against a, a, a top-notch quarterback, it doesn't look like we'll be able to stop Tom Brady. It doesn't look like we'll be able to stop Matt Stafford. It doesn't look like we'll be able to stop Aaron Rodgers. And on the flip side of that, if those defenses do something to stop our offense, I don't think we can run on them. I don't think that we can pass on them. You know what I'm saying? So even though, we, and, and don't be fooled, We've had this. This is a Jason Garrett offense. It's been the same thing forever. We've been able to put up yards. Our offense has been top five. It's just, it's always been that way with Tony Romo and Dak Prescott. But when we go against a defense that has a plan, that knows what to do against our offense, we can't adjust to that.
we can't adjust to that. So that's that's where we are. Um, we're gonna play the Philadelphia Eagles. I'm, I'm pretty sure the Eagles. I, I don't know if the Eagles are gonna play that game. We, there's probably no reason for us to play that game. So next week is gonna be a. Uh, I, I, who knows who's gonna play and who's know who's not gonna play <laughs> on week 18. But as far as the playoffs, um, it's gonna be a game for uh, our first week of playoffs. If we play Philadelphia Eagles, it's gonna be a tough game. If we play Minnesota Vikings, it's gonna be a tough game. This is what it is. All right, guys. Holla at you. Peace out.